And we begin tonight at 9 with residents of the Crosswinds Apartments here in Springfield who spent the day combing through the building trying to salvage what they could after a damaging fire last night. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Lauren Barnes. And I'm Michael Landis. Great to see you tonight. The apartment management and the Red Cross are teaming up to make sure those who were left without a place to stay have somewhere to go. Fox 49's Bethany French is live outside after speaking with the apartment manager earlier today. Bethany. Yes, Mike Lauren, that's right. The building here on South Ingram Mill Road suffered significant damage last night. The apartment manager, Charlie Edmison, tells me that the safety of the tenants is her biggest concern. Our primary goal is to take care of the tenants that we have and, you know, ensure that their safety and they have a new, 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 new place to live that's affordable for them. The Springfield Fire Department said the initial call came in around 6 p.m. yesterday. All tenants and pets made it out safely. The fire department said the building suffered heavy smoke damage and many were left looking for places to stay last night. We um, ensured that they had accommodations, so they have accommodations and now we're doing our best to um, provide them with affordable new homes. The American Red Cross plays an integral role when people are displaced because of a fire. Generally, we would be called by the dispatch at the request of the fire department. Um, who has offered Red Cross services to um, the people who have been impacted by the home fire. Although the Red Cross was not at the scene of the fire yesterday because those involved had places to stay for the night, they are making sure these tenants are taken care of going forward. The Red Cross will be working um, with the property management company and those clients who have been impacted by these fires in the days to come um, to make sure they're taken care of and to work with them to make sure that they are provided for. The apartment manager, Charlie Edmison, tells me she's been in touch with all of the tenants, and this has been a difficult time for those involved. And we're chaperoning them through their apartments to take out their belongings to ensure their safety. The fire department has not released the cause of the fire at this point, but we will be sure to update you when that information becomes available. Reporting in Springfield, Bethany French, Fox 49 News. 